So as you all probably know, I am a huge fan of Natalia Dyer. I mean, just fucking look at my Dead by Daily gameplay. I'm always playing as Nancy. And a few months ago, I just so happened to stumble upon the Yes God Yes trailer, and I instantly knew that I needed to watch this movie as soon as possible. So when it was finally released, I watched it, and I was not disappointed at all. The movie is about a young Catholic girl, played by Natalia Dyer, who goes to a Catholic school. She seems like a pure and innocent child until one night, on a group chat, on a computer from the early 2000s, someone starts getting a little bit sexual with her, and she kind of does get a little curious. She then proceeds to do the, um, the dirty. And then she's like, hey, that's pretty cool. Why have I never done this before? And then she feels like she's wrong. She's going to go to hell for doing it because it's not a part of God's plan. And that's the whole plot of the movie, basically. Alice is kind of an outcast at school because there's a rumor going around that she had a one night stand with a guy named Wade and she supposedly tossed his salad. Now, I'm not going to tell you what that means, so you can just go look it up for yourself if you're that curious. Alice ends up going on a little trip where she meets a boy named Chris and damn, look at all that arm hair, boy! Alice notices his fucking jungle of an arm and instantly falls in love with it. So what I'm getting from this is I have to have a fucking jungle of an arm to get Natalia Dyer to notice me? Okay, okay. Chris isn't really too important to the story. He only shares like a few scenes with Alice during this short movie. With one being to what I believe is the best scene in the entire movie where Alice just starts randomly making out with Chris and then Chris pushes her away and gets up and says, Oh no, you turned me on like an oven! <laughs> Fucking great. <laughs> and that's really all there is for the Alice and Chris relationship. Nothing goes beyond that and uh... Yeah, I guess Alice was just using Chris for his arm hair. The rest of the movie is just Alice coincidentally finding people doing sexual actions and her getting turned on and using random objects to help her do the deed. Without giving away too many major spoilers, that is basically Yes God Yes summed up in about two minutes. Now I thought this movie was pretty funny, but that was probably just because I was with two of my friends and we're pretty childish. And all the jokes in this movie are pretty childish too, so it's kind of perfect for us. Especially that fucking oven bit that Chris says. Oh my god, we laughed for like 10 minutes straight. We had to pause the movie and just laugh. <laughs> to me, the ending of this movie was a little bit disappointing, but it wasn't a completely horrible ending. I still kind of enjoyed it, but it just wasn't what I expected. But I mean... That's okay, it was still overall a pretty good movie, I thought so. My overall score of the movie would be a 8.5 out of 10 because it was funny, cute, and had Natalia Dyer in it, which would always boost the fucking score because it's Natalia motherfucking Dyer. The only real problem I had with the movie was it was really short and I felt like there was a bunch of different stories they could have expanded upon, but it was only an hour and 17 minutes, so... They didn't really do that. I would highly recommend this movie to anybody, especially if you're a huge Natalia Dyer fan just like me, and I think it'll be perfect for you. So yeah, guys, those are my thoughts on Yes, God, Yes. Leave your thoughts on the movie down in the comments below. I would love to hear what you guys thought about the movie. Go ahead and drop a like and subscribe and hit that bell so you get notified every single time that I post a video. You'll never miss one of my videos ever again if you hit that bell go ahead and drop me a follow on twitch i'm live every monday wednesday and friday and i love interacting with you guys in real time so with all that being said i hope you guys enjoyed the video stay safe stay healthy i love you all and i will see you all later <gasps> goodbye